Hi guys, I am uh, here in what is called it? This was uh, Marriott in Los Angeles airport, and uh, I am busy until now. I haven't gotten my breakfast. You haven't eaten your breakfast? No, I didn't eat breakfast. And then I'm coming here, and I met this great two people. Yeah, and uh, you introduce yourself. My name is Rich. I'm Kim. And the Rich is from from New York. And Ken? Ken is from Atlanta. From Atlanta. Okay. I asked them uh, what they do, and they said that they invest. And I've been thinking about. I'm always in, in, interested in investment in people, especially they are talking about interest in people for the retirement. I would love to hear about, more about that. Even though I don't want to retire, and I'm not going to retire for the <laughs> rest of my life. You believe it or not? I will explain to you later. And then they asked me what I'm doing, and then I can you just hold on to it. And I tell them that uh, this, Indiana? yeah, this is that. Okay, and because I'm Chinese, I'm not reading so accurately using my accent English. So I would love to have rich, rich, right, rich, right. Yes, ma'am. Rich to read to me to to all the people, audience. Okay, whatever you watch. Sure. What is that? Leadership is the capacity to translate vision into reality. All right. So I'm just introduced to them. I said, my name is Bai Mingliu, by the way. Hi. And、uh, this is what my what I'm doing, and this is what is my mission.、Oh. And then I carry help people to carry out their dreams, and、uh, that's what I'm doing. That's my mission. Okay. By the way, I can explain to you. Okay. Maybe I you you should record to me, right?、What? So this is real life. Okay. I'm going to wear this. Am I looking okay? Yes, beautiful. <laughs> okay, my name is Bai Mingliu, and thirty years ago I came from. By the way, I'm introduce you that way you can hear who I am. I'm a. Let me try this one. Is it better, right? Is it better, right? They're、okay. both good. Both good. Yeah. You, you have to tell me honestly which one is better. I think if you're comfortable like that, that. This one. Yeah. Natural, right? Yeah. Okay. And a young, right? Yes. Okay. Get Starbucks behind you too. Okay. <laughs>、uh, okay. I love to accept this one. Okay.、Uh, I will explain to you later. My came out, came to this country 30 years ago, and I used to be a professor in teaching international law, international politics. Wow. And、uh, then I came as a Fulbright Scholar from China. Do you know Fulbright Scholar?、Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah. And can you explain to? No, I just know what a Fulbright Scholar is. That's very impressive. Yeah. What is a Fulbright Scholar? It's like、uh, full scholarship, like a Rhodes type scholarship. Yeah. So this is give U.S. government to give the scholarship to distinguished scholars overseas.、Mm-hmm. So I have that honor, and then I went to Cornell University. When、It's、I went. To- Yeah, yeah, I'm still in New York. So when I go to Cornell University, I graduate from Cornell University, and then I become a researcher in Cornell Institute, Cornell Institute for Economics, research in economics.、Uh, and after that, and I become I I I become my son, and I went to. Uh, Washington D.C. Long story short, and then after that, I feel like、uh, life is so great, right? And then I become a join a company for the West End as an education researcher.、Okay. And、uh, it's interesting that when I go to the company, I have lunch. lunch and I'm gonna sit there and I just talk and I go eat. And then I found a person sit next to me, and、uh, I'm just love people. I'm just trying to talk. I saw that this is a, a, a person clean the bathroom. What is it called? Janitor. Janitor. Okay. And I, but I, I don't judge people. I said that's just a nice job, you know, talking. And then this person said, ask me, what are you doing? I said, well, I'm looking for the opportunity because I'm coming from Washington D.C.、Uh, up to New York, and I want to find some opportunity that for my son. So my son happened to fill out the forms and、uh, happened to be joining Johns Hopkins summer camp. And because of that, I have to change my job, right? So I, I just for the consultation job, consultant job, consultant job, so that way I don't lock myself. 
and then over there, and uh, I said, well, I'm on to find a job there. She said, well, what do you want to do? I said, I might explain who I am and things like that. It's a consultant job. Why not join us? Join you to the clinic or do the janitor or what? <laughs> no, I, I didn't say it, but I'm mm -hmm. thinking about it. And I said, tell me about yourself. And this person mm -hmm. tell me, he is the vice president for the company. He said, why are you joining the consultant? Join us, our team. Then I become over there and I start from there and I you know, work harder and then start from research and, and then senior research and become the senior study director for the company. I'm a Chinese, but I'm proud to be the leader for the team with all different nationalities. That's great. Okay. And after that, I've been there for 20 years. But I never feel that I change life for better. Okay. And then until the time I have my friend, and she got, she is the friend's friends, uh, my, um, and they told me that they have a wife and a daughter long uh, breast cancer. And I said, well, you are the second person in my life had the breast cancer, the cancer. The first person, my dear friend, died at the age of 50 and on his birthday, long cancer. That time I couldn't do anything, you know? So you're the second person I'm going to involve in the process no matter what. So then I introduced some people who understand the nutrients, things like that. And then she accepted our, the, the doctor's suggestion and the doctor with the knowledge of nutrients, okay? And she accepted that. And then, it's amazing things happen. And she will come the very well and all this. And the oncologist said, what did you do? So that was the time she, when she told me, I feel this calm. 20 years being a research never changed people's life. Okay. And now I'm not a physician. I can change this person. Right? If I'm doing this all by myself and for 24 by 7 or maybe 8 hours by, you know, I can how many people I can do. But the people are never be. So, so volunteer to make change. So even while I wish, but I will. And uh, nothing happened until the time my father got, uh, had very, very sick. Asked me to come to to China, back to China, because my mom passed away one time. So I went up back to China. I said I want to stay as long as possible. Everything done, and then I go back. I know I told myself as a daughter, and only my father for so long because I have to because of scholarship. I have to stay with him. Twenty years. I feel like I need to do something. So no matter what happened, I'm staying. So after four uh, four months, I stay there. Coming back, my funding is gone. Okay. So I, sorry, I might get emotional. So I said, well, I never thought about it as a professor scholar, as a professor in a very distinguished university in China. That was a university present region when we visit. I'm, I was as a student representative, I'm on the ABC News. Okay, so if anybody can go back to ABC News, that was me. So I'm very proud of it. Uh, with all those experience and went to Cornell University and with a so professor scholar plus the senior study director, I even lost my job. I just cannot stand it. I was so depressed at that time. And uh, I said, why does that happen to me? And I wait. And finally I got an answer. Everything is arranged. I closed that door, asked me to do this. Do you have a pass me to that but that's okay that's my natural I you don't need to know that's okay that's authentic and I, after that I'm saying I accept that fact I'm going forward so at the time I build up a platform called the global Chinese health I become the founder and I want to help all those Chinese people to find the best nutrients for themselves so at a point in time they don't need to if anybody gets cancer they don't need to do chemo mm -hmm. sorry i cannot say publicly that but i can say 
because the, all the illnesses, cancer, is because our cell unhealthy. Okay, so everything is un cells unhealthy, then you got sick. Then, you, then when you got a cancer, okay, all the things. But I would. Okay, so because of that, I'm so excited. I'm just looking for all the products and things, and also I will help some people who had experience like me, and they are less fortunate. They have less capable to deal with things. A lot of people lost their job. What they can do? They might have, some people might make suicide. Some people might kill themselves. Some people might do something stupid. Okay, and I will teach those people. No matter how hard it is, there's something for you. So I found myself. I'm this one. I'm so excited. I'm went to not only for sorry, not only for the help of people to have stay healthy. I want to help people to be in control in their lives. Okay, we are not a free. I thought we have all freedom. I thought I I have the great job. I can. Go there on Saturday and Sunday for the freedom. But when I lost my job, I know there's no freedom for ourselves. And I want people. Whenever you have job, you know you have to have plan. But even you don't have job, that's good because you have opportunity to find a better one. Okay. So now I found a company. I experienced ten more than ten companies because I learned to grow. Because that's out of my another area. Now I found a great company that helped me to carry out my mission. My mission have three things. Okay, first one to be the best person I can be. Okay, and second one is to help people around me to be the best person that they would like to be. I got one of to be. Third one to be the best servant I can be. I can be. Trained, I can be qualified of those. And now, because of my experience, for lost my job, I never thought about I can make money. When I lost job, I saw some people less fortunate than me, less educated than me, make more money than me. I said, oh, what the point for education? I got all the degrees. I finally lost my. Now I want to make more because I'm educated. I want to make. The money I never be able to make at a job. Job is the job to give you just a live, a life to survive, to make a basic living. But we want to have our life make a significant, significant. We want to have the in, make not only make a living, but we make an impact. So now I found a company that is called Genes. Genes is a huge company, and it can help me to realize my dream. This is a company that I just got yesterday. Okay, so see how wonderful it can feel like. To me. And who is who I am? It doesn't matter knowing my name or Chinese name or English name. Or it doesn't matter, but knowing that I am the leader. To transform, to have the capacity to, even now I have the capacity, I can learn and to grab the capacity to transform the vision into reality. Yesterday I went to Hollywood. I, sorry, I never spent so much money on the <laughs> Hollywood. Do you know what is the Hollywood best hotel? Beverly Wilshire. No. <laughs> That's called Louis. Hello, Louis. So I spent twelve hundred dollars for stay there two days, and when they're over there, I saw the vision. Outside the view, I I will show you that later on before. I see totally great view. That was connect afterwards after I took on the plane. When you're on the plane, you see the sky. You're above the sky. You're above the clouds. 
and because you are in the position, you are different, and you see the things different. So that's how you have vision, right? So in the Hollywood, that hotel, I, I asked for to give me the highest one. So I got a, get a chance to stay in the 17th floor. So I have the whole, I want to have a best view to see the Hollywood. I did. <clears throat> and then I come here and to see the difference. This is a five-star hotel, but there's no way to compare with the Hollywood, the best hotel. <clears throat> I can give you a simple example. I'm uh, going to, <clears throat> if you are in a good position, if you are in a good position, every company, everything, they will tell you, okay, um, sorry, in the mic, sorry, you're tired. Anyway. Arms. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Let me, I'm at a, every, if you find the right uh, hotel, it will provide everything, even include the hair, uh, the, the, look, the con condition, mm -hmm. shampoo and the condition. That is shampoo and the condition with the vitamins. <laughs> It's called a healthy hair condition, healthy shampoo. But right here, they don't have it. And also another thing <coughs> is that, you know the, the cotton swap? Yeah, cotton swap. Q-tips. Yeah, Q-tips, sorry, uh -huh. thank you. Yeah. And over there, they prepared everything. And here, I couldn't even find a few tips. Okay, this, even this is a five-star hotel, all right? <coughs> and another thing. The same thing, I'm in the... Do you still want me recording? Yes, yes. Okay. I promise two minutes I'm finished. Okay. And then in the hotel, I, I, I didn't eat anything. But in the hotel, they prepare you for the chocolate and the everything. I can just grab it to eat it. But here I can not I have to go downstairs to eat. So I just tell you, people, <coughs> you stand in different places, so you can see the difference. But if you don't hit that place, you cannot see it. That's why this is my mission, to be the leader, to bring, translate, translate the vision into the reality. Okay, thank you so much for your request.